to the third episode of African Cocktail coming to you from Africa Radio this day, Wednesday, the 27th of August 2014, with Gile Charles KB as main guest. And of course, uh, one of our main guests will be joining us just right ahead. Her name is Edith Piqua. Uh, Boma, she's a Cameroonian actress who lives in Houston, Texas. And of course, uh, she is uh, a 2014 Golden Icons Academy Movie Awards Gamma nominee. All right, at exactly 3 minutes to 11, let's move to Texas, where Edith Piqua is already on the line. Edith, you're welcome to African Cocktail. Thank you. So, how are you, Edith? Good. Apparently, this is the first time you're taking part uh, on African Cocktail. Yes. Hmm. Okay. So, uh, here we promote talent. Talent like you. I know you are one of them, and you've just uh, been uh, nominated uh, for the 2014 Golden Icons Academy Awards uh, in the Best Promising Actress in the Diaspora category. So, tell me, when news of this nomination got to you, what was your immediate reaction? Oh, my God. <laughs> Actually, I was sleeping. So, when I woke up, I got a text from a friend. It was like, congratulations on your nominee. I was like, is this a preschool or what? <laughs> he told me, he told me, just go on, online and check. So, when I went on Giamma, I mean, Giamma. I've been on Giamma for like two years, the first year and the second year, like like an audience. So I know what Giamma is all about. So I was like, Giamma? So when I went and checked, I was, my name, Edith Pippa Boma. See, I screamed like a baby. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still imagine. very excited. I can't wait for October. Hmm. Okay, she can't wait for October. Definitely, October will come with some good tidings. So what was... Uh, uh, what were the people around you saying about this nomination, Edith? Um, well, my friends, my families, you know, I told them they were like, because they knew how I started. I started in January, so they were like, this is so fast. Are you serious? But I told them determination and focus, and see, you have to be focused in what you want to do. Right. But they were like, they were, they are excited. Hmm. So I was going through the uh, Giamma nomination list and I realized that you will be contesting in the same category with uh, other renowned actresses uh, on the continent, uh, notably Cameroon's Stephanie Ma, uh, who is one of your compatriots. Uh, do you consider this a tough contest, uh, Edith? I don't know. Before you put there as a nominee for Giamma, it means they must have seen your work and it's worth being a nominee. Hmm. So I just believe all of us are winners. So anybody that wins, I'm happy. Just hmm. my name being there, I'm so happy. Right. I started in January, so January to August. <laughs> I'm a nominee for Giamma. Hmm. Because I'm a winner. Just, that, that's all I want. <laughs> nominee for <laughs> Giamma from January. Are you kidding me? <laughs> right. <laughs> Edith thinks that a Giamma no, a nomination is uh, already a Giamma win. Okay. Yeah. So, um... Yeah. What have you been doing so far to ensure uh, you have as more votes uh, as this uh, competition uh, comes up? Actually, for this category, they don't vote. I wish they, they, they were voting. If they right. had to vote, <laughs> I'm sure <laughs> by now, because I know myself, I'm somebody is very sociable, so my friends vote, everybody will vote. So. But for this category, they don't vote. The right. panel actually just chose the winner. Ah, so it is the jury that uh, does that? Yes. Wow. Yes. Mm, okay. That's why like anybody can. Right. Yeah. So you definitely have your fingers crossed. Yeah, definitely. Okay. I'm right. positive. Hmm. <laughs> so, Edith, for how long have you been acting and um, which are some of the movies you featured in so far? Uh, actually, I've been acting since January 2014. Ah, so I had a yeah. passion, yeah, a long time ago, but you know, I came to this country, I had to go to school, right. take care of my family, had my kids, so I'm done with that. So I was like, okay, let me go into acting now. For right. So I started acting in January, so, so and for, in January to now, I've been like in eight months. So nine movies, yeah, I've featured like eight movies so far. Hmm, so you only got into professional acting eight months ago, and you featured in eight, eight movies already? Yes. Wow, that's interesting. <laughs> hmm. It's gone. 
So, who are some of the actors you've worked with uh, these past eight months? Um, uh, I've worked with people like in the um, uh, Melissa, um, Masoni um, Okozi, um, there are some few actors in the diaspora actually mm. been opportunities to be on set with them. Right. And, and I've learned a lot from each and every one of them because I'm a good listener. I like to listen. Mm-hmm. Now, uh, Edith, eight months into this uh, noble uh, art, how would you assess your performance so far? And do you have any regrets uh, having uh, 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 chosen this uh, uh, career of yours? Oh, no. This is something that my life itself is acting. Among my friends, I, I always like to, you know. So I don't regret. This is what I like. It's, it's a passion. This is what I, I just love doing it. I just love doing it. I don't have any regrets. And with time, I get better. Hmm. You know, like from... January to now, when I get on set, I get better, better, better by the so. Right. And um, I guess you are a member of the Cameroon Film Industry Actors Guild here in the United States of America. Uh, how would you assess the growth of uh, the art within the Cameroonian community? Oh, they're growing fast. As you can see, most of the um, movies now, Cameroonian movies now, they have standards. We are really trying right now, so I really, 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 really appreciate the Cameroon film industry. We are working hard to at least get up there, and we are doing our best. Hmm. Okay. Uh, Agents, since uh, people don't expect to vote, uh, what would you be telling your fans? To pray for you? <laughs> <laughs> pray for me, yes. To pray for me, and just, we can't expect anything. I'm, I'm already, see, I'm so happy. Hmm. Just being a nominee, as I say, right. it's a win for me. Hmm. Hey, <laughs> you don't even know. Yama, so, a nominee, I'm, I'm already a winner. So this kind <laughs> of uh, motivates you to work even harder? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Hmm. Oh, yes. Yama is a big show, so um, that really is motivating me a lot. I'm so, so impressed. I'm happy. Just where do you intend to find yourself in the next five years, Edith? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> At the apex of five the years, the next five years. <laughs> hmm. Maybe I will be the next. Uh, <laughs> well, we'll never know. Hollywood, anywhere. Okay. <laughs> I never say never. Okay, <laughs> never say yeah, never. 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 <laughs> <laughs> That's a beautiful one day it is. Thank you so much for joining us eh, in this edition of African Cocktail. We hope to have you again some other time, probably in October, when you would have lifted that trophy. Amen. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> I'm bringing that over. <laughs> okay, so do have a fantastic time, Edith, and uh, thanks so much. Thanks so much for joining us. Okay, have a good day.